and welcome to the Plus Lounge. It is Poppy J. <coughs> Special guests in the house. And your boy D Fresh. Oh, yeah, D Fresh. I forget. You be having so many names, so. I know. It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a long time, bro. It's been a long while. Yeah, it's been a minute. Yeah, it's been a little while. Uh, I don't even know how to Welcome start. Welcome to it's the... It's been a while. Chill, nigga. This ain't Inspect the show. game. Chill. This ain't the show. Game. Come on, man. What's up? What's up? Chill. Just relax. Welcome to now. the Plush Lounge. What's up? Dude, this dude... Just relax. Let me do my intro. Okay. Welcome to the Plush Lounge. <laughs> Welcome to the Plush Lounge. Uh, used to be formerly known as Talking Real 1000, but we decided, I mean, we decided to switch things up a little bit. Uh, this one is going to be more about just refl- like looking at reflecting on our own selves. So we, I call it respect the game where you look back at some things you might have done or how you might have viewed things and then honestly weigh in whether you was really respecting the game or not. When I say the game, I mean like to me, life is a gamble. I live like I've always viewed life as a gamble. So it falls in gaming with me. You're gambling. You understand what I'm saying? You're taking a chance. You are investing money, for hoping to hit the jackpot. No difference. You're investing in a relationship, hoping that you'll never like be together to the day you die. When you get laid every day. So every aspect of life, there's there's there was a there's a like unwritten rules. Like you, yeah, yeah, you're right. Nobody should tell you to be nice. You should just be a nice person. You shouldn't like if, and That's we're not we're not saying what oh, okay. life is or not. We're saying in general, if you are a good a good person is a good person. It don't matter what color, what sex, what race, any none of that. A good person will be a good person all the time. That's right. Not when they feel like being a good person. Right. And I know a few of those. So even in that area, are people really good people then? Like are like when you look at certain things or how you move now, your mindset now, are you really respecting the game? Are you really a good person? Be are you keeping it a thousand? Are you keeping it a buck? Are you are you doing any of that? Are you really practicing what comes out your mouth? Are you really standing for what comes out your mouth? So respect the game falls. This it's just I this viewed a lot of things over the last <coughs> two years with the COVID. Okay. And there's a lot of games that was always there that we just as people wasn't respecting. Okay. So you fighting something that the unwritten rule just is set in stone for that. How they try to say a relationship should be like this. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if you're a street person, then your life comes with this. <laughs> if you're a rapper, then you go traveling and you get all that stuff that comes with rapping. You understand what I'm saying? Copy. So everything has a lane. Everything has rules that you can't mix everything with. You can't be a street dude. You can't be a street dude. And expecting a church girl to understand you from the gate without you ever talking, which I'm messing with each other. You know what I'm saying? Like, what do you, you like, and then be upset and call each other out. And then this, and, and, and instead of looking back and saying, hey, I, my bad. No, you'll be like, yo, that bitch ain't shit. That bitch is a hoe. Oh, that nigga's a bum ass nigga. Like, and you'll, we'll, we'll bash each other. To hold, keep our little <laughs> false sense of <coughs> keeping it a buck. Yeah, so you understand right. what I'm saying? When you know damn well you was gambling when you thought that you was gonna just come out of anywhere and change the street. <laughs> like that's a gamble. That same thing when you tell you you think you're gonna change a uh, that what's that saying? Can't turn a hoe into a housewife. I mean, listen, it's a gamble. It is a gamble. And this is what I'm saying. So you how, what, why are we, why respect the game then? It's a gamble, you lost. You ain't beating up the dealer when you lose. You ain't 
You ain't smacking around the dealer right, when so, you lose. So, so right? No, you're not. But so what you saying in respect the game. So who you think is not respecting the game? Today? I don't think mad people is respecting the game. Just give me something. I'm mad people, like a lot of people, like you know who I'm gonna go to. No, I'm to, I'm not even talking about I'm you talking know who I'm gonna look, go to. I'm my talk- number one, because I couldn't wait to get on here to like basically go ham on this. Nah, thing. we ain't doing no personal attack. Well, you man. know who I'm talking about. It's not a personal attack. I'm talking about I like my I like the person that I'm talking I'm talking of. I don't want to say their name. But they not respecting I, the game. No, he no, they're not. They not. But what game and they the people, you gotta at least give us the game. We don't do the names, but you gotta give us the game. Basically, you know, is it a like selling these, selling out, trying to, you know, crying about baby because the baby mama done moved on. The baby mama is with, you know. So oh, you talking about? You know who I'm talking. We talked now, about it earlier. Okay? We did. I didn't remember. No, about not it. earlier, but we talked about it when I talked to you last time. Oh. Okay. But what I'm saying is, is that I like my men. But, right, but we look I love his creativity. Look, you know, look, look, but, look, but it just the way he's going, and no one is like really just like see what I think is put it like this. I think a lot of a lot of celebrities, a lot of celebrities that was broke before they made it, and then they a lot of them they 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 start straying and start figuring out, okay, I got money. So then they start doing weird shit. Some of them they start doing weird shit. I think that when they start falling off. They need regular motherfuckers like us. They need a couple of regular niggas, like regular people, excuse my language, but a regular people, like, hey, they need to have contact with somebody. Like, yo, man, you know how foolish you look right now? You don't think nobody telling that nigga that? No. Yeah, I do. I don't think so. Nah, you bugging. That's what I'm saying. So. But see, it's different from it's different if it's coming from somebody else who got the same that's coming from the same pedigree as from you. Dude, you don't think I would take I would you don't think that I would take that I would be like this. I would take that information that better. Nah, I, I probably I wouldn't take it from you because you are on the same level as me. Now a person who ain't got shit. Hello. Like a person. Oh, I thought I sent it. Yeah. You won't pause for the cause. And, and we and this is what we do. We pick up the phone during a live show, right? Because that's what we do. This is what we do. Pick up the phone on a live show. I hope that was a million dollar call. Listen, like I said, dude. But this is what I'm saying. You now let's broaden it out, though. This is what a, a lot of people is like. That. People we know, people, some people that uh, your neighbor, like. A lot of people is like that, dude. A lot of people can't move. They are. This is what our niggas ain't respecting the game. Shit, I let me tell you something. You know when you don't respect the game, what happens? No, let you, me tell you something. How you, you get robbed? <laughs> you know what? No, it's not even that. It's that's again. <laughs> this is why. I, I and look, I, this, I, and I, that, I, this is a relation. This is a game that I don't like playing, and this is why I don't be in mad relationships because I don't like that gamble. It was cool one time. It was worth the gamble before. It's not. It's a headache. It it, it derails you from what you're trying to. Go. Yeah, it does. All right. So that aspect of everything. It really does. But that's it. But I know that now. So I don't have to entertain playing that game. You know what I'm saying? Like Absolutely. that nigga is sick because, and I don't even understand because. This is me, and this is me with my respect to game. The factor is, dude, as much, nigga, I wrote a book, so I know niggas could make movies. Look, I wrote a book of just the shit that I was able to do. Right. The fortune, being as fortunate as right. I was. And right? I, know, no. I know a lot of that. Listen, that listen, book. but this is not, that's not even the point. The right. point is, I might have been in a couple of situations while that shit was going on so can i be mad if i come around and and see the thing or something else <laughs> no no and it's not something that everybody could do so wait, that, wait. But, so but you that, so you partake in in something that it might have not been like that might have that might have deemed it, it, it okay been, that like okay you need to respect the game like 
like, like it, it could have <laughs> looked like a relationship. Do y'all hear this, ladies and gentlemen? I'm just telling you. Remember, what he just said. This was the old. It looked like a relationship. Yeah, it could have looked like a relationship. What a relationship looks like. People that you see with a lot. Because people assume you're in a relationship. If you see somebody, if you see somebody, if you see me with one girl, a lot of times, you everybody will assume that that's my girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, then. So I know what the fuck I'm saying. Yeah. I can identify with It could look like a relationship. Yeah, true. Especially... And this is what gets all the the mix-ups because now right. everybody on the ones on ones is like, yeah, I ain't know you. I do that thing. Uh. And next thing you know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and now you commit to something that now you gotta fucking argue with me about oh, something that I don't even know because you ain't told somebody some other shit. Right. Right. Not respecting the game. Right. Because we that wasn't the lane that it started it. So when you decide to like switch tra- tracks or stop somewhere. You should let a nigga know that the, that the track is splitting right here. And do you want to continue on? <laughs> like, you should fucking have that option. It shouldn't be, uh, yeah. it shouldn't be as tricky as it is, like, how it was, you know, right. know, when you would thought it was. The viewers, the viewers should know that both of y'all niggas are looking the way y'all look because y'all came from work and just <laughs> okay, you know decided what? to record. I, all right. So I had all to right. commit to this because I already had posted that I was going to do it today. First of all, uh, I want to say, what's up, Poppy J, my boy Wise, okay, probably to the people. Um, it's been a little while since. Uh, this some confession shit? Nah. I no, 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 no. I got to know. It's things. not one of those. I was going to sit back. Nah, no, like, no, no, no. Nah, um, it's just, I want to say, um, it's been a, while, a little while since I've been sitting in here me too i like what you did with the, the studio um it's, it's a lot that's it no 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 it's a lot been going on i just wanted to you know want to find out from you like what's been going on with you and how the book and all of that i just wanted to know you know what's the book and all of that it's slow motion right now okay like i mean i gotta find the right I gotta find the right spot. It's a different book. Actually, yes, it is. So, you got the placement. Just figuring out the placement. I gotta sign up for some book fest then to get it out there further. But more work. It's still more work. I never thought it was gonna be some overnight shit. You gotta be somebody. Okay. You do gotta be somebody. Yeah, I ain't okay. stupid. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I respect the game. It still was worth the investment because. It's like time in due time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I like that respect again because I remember when I was in respect for shit. And I told you I live my life by that shit now. I think about all the different choices I made. And then I'd be like, I, I got to respect this shit. Like, this is the game. Yeah, that's why you see me in this. Whatever show. backlash, the outcome of it, I can't be like crying and, and being like, yo. That my fault. Why? Why me? Why me? I'm so good. You know what I'm saying? Like all that shit. I remember when I used to do that when I was, but you know something? Once I realized that I, I am my worst enemy and that only me, only I can hold my I can hold my only hold myself back. It's what I do is what basically um hampers what the outcome of my life is once I realized that and grabbed hold of myself and shook myself for the real and just said like nigga. You said nigga? Well yeah and, uh, what you, you said out loud when you did it? Yeah. Oh, literally. Yeah. I just wanted to know if you did it out loud. Yeah, I did yeah. it out loud when I said it. Yeah, I did it out loud like yeah. nigga. What the fuck? I ain't do nigga though. Well, I mean shit. I know I that started with what the fuck. <laughs> it always starts with the what the fuck you do. You know what I'm what saying? The what the fuck? Yo, bro. And then I never get to nigga. And then it's straight up. Nah, what the fuck? It's like, what the fuck? And then I'm like, nigga, you need to tighten up. You need to stop that shit. You need to stop jerking off in the middle of the night. <laughs> All right. So since I'm, we've been ta- since y'all been tossing around the N-word a lot, I'm sorry. I want to bring up the Joe Rogan situation. 
man. Don't, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I love you. See, I love Let's that go. you said that. Listen, man, I want to hear where he's going with I this. love that you said that. Don't you know that he, Wait, they wanna, mysteriously dude, took his shit off of Spotify? Dude, I want to see where he was going. He's the man. I like Joe. I, I like the JR. That's my Yeah, dude. I don't think, listen, I, for me personally, I don't think it came from a racist point of I, of, of you, saying it. You know something? Only like, a, only, like there's, there's certain people you know when they say, you. when they thank say you. it, they say it as a racist. Thank you. Thank I you. don't think it was the tone as much. I just I don't, don't appreciate the one what the, what I didn't like was the Planet of the Eight comments. I don't give a fuck about that. He's a fucking comedian. I, I, don't know, care. I know. I know. I understand care. that. Yo, I niggas understand act like that. Your son. But right you. now, people hold on, hold are on. very hey, sensitive. I feel you. Everybody's sensitive. But I don't give a fuck. He can say that shit to his face fucking, fucking turn blue. We act like we don't fucking sit there and clown on white people. We do it to their face sometimes. Let me tell you a perfect example. I'm in Oregon, okay? We, me, and I'm, I'm with white motherfuckers. So we coming from San Francisco because we took a vac, we was on vacation. And we driving on um, 101, the Pacific Highway. So we're back, go on our way back to Seattle. Um, I mean, we stop off in, 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 in Oregon. Basically, then um, they go to a hotel. I'm like, they want to go in the pool. I don't want to go in the pool, so fuck it. I wanted to finish off the little joint. And shit. The little joint um that i got so i'm smoking walking and shit come to the light waiting for the light to change but meanwhile while i'm walking everybody that passed by i swear to god bro i could have been i thought i was like a, a superstar i'm like maybe they think i'm some famous rapper or some shit because i'm clean as hell and i'm in oregon i've never been there so everybody that went by they all i seen was who they thought you were I don't know who they thought I was, but they, they was breaking their neck like to see me because I'm the only nigga walking down this this road. Man, come to the light, sitting there, pulling on my little joint, looking around like, okay. Somebody light turn, me. light change, all I, yep, all I hear is, nigga! So I looked around, I'm looking around like, who the fuck you talking about? Who, where the nigga at? So then I, I fucking had to remember, I'm like, oh shit, you talking about me? So for, I'm like, oh man, fuck Man, so I'm talking, walking, 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 son. I come down to some diner. Why did I walk into the diner? I don't know what the fuck day this was or whatever, but they had like, they had like some swap meet or some uh, meet up where, you know, they had old cars, you know, like back in the day, old ass 1957 fucking big ass car. Man, I'm, when the music stopped, when I start walking by, all I see is them old ass white dudes. <laughs> And all their heads turned, yo, I turned around, made a beeline right back to the hotel. But at the same time, when they said, call me a nigga, at first I was I was upset. But then I thought about it. I started laughing after I thought about it because I was like, you know what? Ain't no, there's no difference from me driving around. When, <laughs> when I used to, God bless the dead, my nephew, we used to drive around. We used to, I used to, we used to smoke. And I would yell out, I see a white motherfucker, I'd be like, Fucking cracker, crack ass cracker. You know what I'm saying? So I would do that shit. So I'm, I'm like, I don't give a fuck. So if Joe Rogan, whatever Joe Rogan, is, I don't. That shit ain't affecting. So does, me. so does that make you a racist? No, it don't. I'm racist to it. You know what? Everybody's a racist to a degree to some fucking other person. Okay, so I see, I need, I need y'all to understand the definition of racism. Exactly. You have no power over anyone, so you're not necessarily a racist. Maybe a bigot, maybe, but a racist is someone who has power over someone else, and and and, and they're the able to you, abuse that. At, at, I'm saying, right. But a right. bigot now is someone who hates you because of your color of your skin. See, all of that's still the same. Do you know what? All yeah, that's, that's still some falls, bullshit. That still falls. Man, under let me the tell you something. Shit. Man, you don't fucking. You don't. You, you, you have power shit. over somebody. You have power over your children. You, you do have power over your community. The, you, you have if you instill if you if you instill it. that shit, it's gonna be instilled. That's it. It's not you ain't that's power over somebody. It don't matter when you become the person that has power over more people. You don't got levels to when they oh I ain't a racist until I'm over a hundred 
follow us or some shit. Yo, like, ever, that's what I got ever, it. Ever since they started, <laughs> started. I ain't a bigot. A bigot is separate from a racist. Like, I don't like you because you're not the same, same race color. as me. Yeah, the same so color. So, of course, you're going to be this, a different color. Yeah, but that's so a bigot and a racist is the same shit. Let's stop playing these word games. It Respect is the, same. the game. It's the same. Don't mix them up and break it down so that you got different groups. All these fucking groups is killing me. Yo, bro, that was the funniest thing ever, man. I swear to God. So I, when I got back to the hotel, I go to my, I go to my boat. I go, yo, guess what, man? Yo, I just got called a nigger. <laughs> he looks at me and butts out laughing. Now he's white himself, straight from um, Wisconsin. You know what I'm saying? And he starts laughing too. He starts laughing because he thought I was joking at first, and he thought like kind of like I was offended. He thought I got was offended, so he laughed. No, 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 no. Let me get it right. Yeah, get it right. Yeah, because he he did think I was, he he started laughing at first, but then when he saw my face, he thought I was offended because I wasn't smiling. You know what I'm saying? I thought he would be a little sensitive to the fact because of it, you know why because I, why that never happened i'm just saying why it went because why I, would you think i would thought he would have been a little wasp because i'm black and he's white and we was in an all-white town okay you know what i'm saying and i thought he would have been like oh i'm sorry man you know why? what i'm saying why, why does he have to apologize for I, don't say, I don't know. I, I, yo, I mean, it's shit. I, I, listen, <laughs> listen, man. Can be honest with you? I don't. I don't know. I don't know what what I would. And this but is when, what I'm saying, when he started, why, though? But when he started, I don't know. No, this is what I'm saying. I'm I not don't know you now. I'm saying for people to think, like, why? Why would you think that the person you with should be as mad as you? About being See, called that's the something point. that he I don't know shit about. I wasn't too. I wasn't that mad. I was just more shocked. like, sh- yes, that he didn't. No, like, I was more shocked that they said it, and then it, you know, why you in a fucking town with the white people? <laughs> I don't fuck. Why? This is what I keep saying. You ain't respecting the game. I go to a town, my nigga. I wasn't you in a neighborhood it, with nothing but white people. This I wasn't is back then because you are my age. Yeah, a little old. No, this was only this was a maybe like like yeah, it was like 2012. All right. It was like 2012. And what you you went out there, it was still only white people in 2012. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what I'm saying. Why? Why did you was you surprised that somebody called you a nigga? This is I'll what I'm saying. The fact that, that no, there's no because after that. You went you know a what? town of white people there is and you're the only nigga out there. there. That they saw it that day. You know what though? For Oregon, I want to say only time every one damn there, every they were fat as fuck. Look, see, I don't know what and look, this is what I'm saying though. You ain't respect the game, man. Look, Oregon ducks. <laughs> see, look, I don't man, even know that. I don't even know that's the, that, I know Oregon, man. That's the only time you see the black people when they play sports. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? In, in a lot of states. Tail <laughs> raises or Portland. So what I'm yeah, saying yeah, though yeah, is yeah. Joe Rogan, <laughs> Joe Rogan, he I don't know, man. I think that whoever started that shit with Joe Rogan shit. It was some either they shit. was jealous because uh, or he I think because some jealousy going on, or uh or um maybe he pissed somebody off, you know what I'm saying, and they like that. Because first you gotta understand, before they even went to Throwing us in there, they threw yo. It's funny how they set him up because they set him up. The white, the one white dude, he was a a, a a musician. I forget his name. Some old ass, I don't know, yuppie, I don't yippie, IA motherfucker, white dude, whatever. He he said, hey, if you don't take Joe Rogan off here, yeah, I'm taking my music off. Okay, so Spotify told him like basically, no, we not taking him off. You know. You do whatever the fuck you want to do. So, okay. That was a little noise they made with that. Then the next thing you know, here comes Indiana Irie. Talking about, oh, he is, da, 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 she is. I like her breakdown. I listen to it. Yeah, I listen to some of it, it too. Sense. But it kind of went, it, yeah, it made, it made sense. sense. But whatever stuck, it stuck. But whatever it did, it did. Because then I'm thinking like, okay, you get paid one, you get a, uh, uh, I didn't even know that even exists. I don't even know how to even say it. It's like a fraction of a fraction, fraction of a penny. Yeah, it's like stocks. I get it. 
But I didn't even know that shit exists. And that thing. Nice in stock. Oh my god, that shit, <laughs> that shit like ghost money. I it's like, yo, here, let me cut you off for like a tiny piece of this cop, this penny. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, what Spotify do with their money is their business. Just because he is getting paid or they paid him. He's in a different genre, a different bracket of what Spotify is representing. That's what she's forgetting. That's what the white dude is forgetting. They are musicians. He is a fucking podcast and talk show host, freaking, uh, and a comedian. That don't mesh. Just because he said this or said that, it, that ain't stopping your money. I'm like, well, no. why? The, like, why are they? Why they have it, to even go? In the oh, because you know, come well, on, Johnny Mitchell. Well, Johnny Mitchell and 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 um, was it I don't know, was it uh, Neil Young? It was one of those, old, Neil one Young. Those that's the that's the white dude. See, I, anyway, I so they they thing. were they wanted they won they were upset because not because of the n word, not because of nigga, I, 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 because, mean, that was the because of his his supposedly some COVID episode he had, oh, and, that's the way he was saying, yeah. And, you know and he what, was bro. talking about what he was talking about it, and they were talking about it was misinformation. And huh. then we got hit with the the clip of Joe Rogan using the N word all over the place, and Tom, and then he came and he spoke and he spoke and he gave his apologies and he said he, he hasn't used the word since. Whatever, Joe Rogan. If you get to see this, I'm sure you probably won't. Shout out to you, okay, man. Yo, I ain't, I'm not mad at you, brother. I'm not mad at you. I respect the game. I'm respecting the game right now. You say you do what you want to do. You know what I mean? It's time for people to stop crying about everything, man. For real. You know, if he had this other people out there, other people out there who really, really, really stand behind that word and really mean it. Another example, like the one lady. I don't know who she was or whatever she was representing. I forgot because this is how stupid it was. She got caught drunk, her and her husband or some shit like that, talking mad shit. You know what her comeback and recovery was? She said that uh, somebody gave her a, a, a value. She don't even remember saying the N word or some shit like that. So, um, but she got fired from her job. And the husband, I think, got suspended from his job or whatever. And I'm thinking these people are in the privacy of their own home. When the privacy of your own home don't be doesn't become private anymore because someone is sitting there recording some shit and decides to post it. Okay. And then just because Behind closed doors, you're a fucking racist. <laughs> where you going with that? All right, behind, I just want to know where you're going. Okay, okay. okay. so, 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 so you're saying it's okay to be to be a know, racist you behind your, in your in your own house? Like, if you want right. to be a racist, you can be a racist that's in your house. Right, nigga, just don't do it in the street. Thank you. That's Respect what you're saying. Respect me when you see me on the street. I mean, okay. that that's fair. It is. Pretty fair. It is like you, cause that's like me coming in your crib, telling you, nigga, telling you, bro, you can't, you can't sit in here with your underwear on. It's your house. You can't walk around a crib and without your shirt on. It's your house. So it's so so it's okay. So basically, you're saying it's okay to be a racist in your house. I don't give a fuck what you say. <laughs> I don't give a fuck what you say in your crib, nigga. You know what I'm saying? If that, if yeah, that, but somebody recorded. So what you gotta say? That's he. This that person, said. that person that recorded that shit. I hope that lady and that man done fucked them up. Yo, listen <laughs> for real, my nigga. <laughs> because that per well, that person then obviously that person didn't know how to respect the game. Thank you. See? They didn't respect whoever they, they, recorded they, that shit. And they recorded it. a conversation in 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 someone's home. They probably went there for that. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. The world is fucked up right now. I just gonna line people up. Yo, everybody, what do you think? Now I'm going over here. I'm gonna record these dumbasses. Yeah, yeah. Son, 
Oh Yo, my God, bro. Man. You got to respect the game that we play. I, this shit is insane. When I respect it, I respect it. I respect it's it. insane. I do son. respect I respect a lot of it's shit. It's insane. There's, and there's, there's two there's sides to that, man. I don't Somebody respect. just didn't sit there bored. Saying, oh wow, they're racist. <laughs> no, nigga. They sat there like, yeah, I'm gonna catch these niggas. They're gonna make me a fucking give me a thousand views. A oh, views. okay. Let, what I'm all right, let me all right. I mean, right. listen, let me tell you, I, and this is me being like, I really thought about this. <laughs> since you brought this shit up, I just want to make my stance completely clear. But I honestly believe that anybody over the age of 65 that separates right we like what, what ah, we the baby boomers no you want you we, well, we the baby boomers i looked it up recently i did some homework well, anybody born in front so six, but before six, us <laughs> before the baby boomers pop <coughs> anybody born before then it's that is what it was yeah that's what i'm saying when you respect the game that is what it everybody it's got diluted yeah it has they, the they racism the from, look that racism from every race has gotten diluted over the years since the baby boom okay well we really stepped out of that black and white shit black and spanish shit like when it, if you started really integrating with different races the baby boom started that Really? You know what really started it? Like, where I mean, in a man. Hip hop nation, nigga. <laughs> hip hop nation started that shit, yeah, look, nigga. Look, look. But I'm not giving, listen. But at the end of the day, everybody before then, that's what it was, man. Don't fuck with them white people. Yeah. Whether it was out of fear or whatever it was at that time, they had a reason not to fuck. And if none of them experiences is good. In anybody's on anybody's end spectrum. See, and that's that that that's the that's the part that. So um, now you now that's the part so that now, gets me. No, but gets me now is because I have mixed look, kids and then now is that. But this is what I'm trying to say. Now that goes to say, then why the fuck are we still letting these old people run shit? That's me. And that's where we don't. That's respect the game. You ain't changing nobody. Robert Kraft still ain't fucking. There ain't nothing happened about that shit that happened down and and when he got recorded. Okay, you have to um. You have when to he got recorded, you have to educate. Had a sex uh with some Who's Robert Kraft, some, the owner of the fucking Patriots. Oh, the, the 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 what? Nothing. There's certain people that nothing happened to. So pay, I pay attention. I'd be like, oh shit, sex scandals gone, never existed. Not. Nothing, not even a court date. Not even, yo, nothing. No, nothing. You get nothing. Mind your business. <laughs> Mind your business. That was, that's all it was. And then you get somebody else on, on a different, and they, the ones that they could. Like Jeffrey Epstein. Dude, he had mad friends. Hmm. Mad pigs. They went and robbed his crib before they went and robbed. But I ain't talking about that nigga either. Because I ain't fucking with that nigga. He still was a creep. But <laughs> so all these niggas is creep. This is what I'm saying. Them old people shouldn't be like judges shouldn't be lifetime jobs. No, like Supreme shouldn't. Court judges should not. You know be what though? Old. Some of those people. What I get, what I don't. No man. What I don't get is that a lot of those yeah. old, they forget that they were younger ones. No, it's Hold on. they were they younger forget. ones, but it's they were younger ones. No, yeah. you still. Are you snoring on who the fuck? Yeah. And he's running shit. How he's running shit like that, man? Lie. Yeah. Are we? Hey, who yeah, says? we live. Yo, bro. Yo, you snoring on this? Yeah, I say, but man, he can't be like that, man. I don't know where the fuck he is. I don't know how he did. He just go to sleep. That nigga crazy. <laughs> that nigga went to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> he said, y'all ain't live enough for me yet. Yeah, I don't know what he's expecting, man. This was just a, 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 rough, a rough draft. I haven't done this since. I haven't done this since probably y'all was here. The last time we did. I haven't this. recorded that long. It's been like about like six months. Man, life is real. <laughs> life is real. Yeah, I remember the day. Life I hit, nigga. I ain't got time to be talking to people, I, right? That, I don't nah, know what to say. Son, to you. when I left, when I said to you, I was like, bro, I got it. Now nah, I'm good. 
I, I was pumping my bag. I was like, boy, I gotta go make that. I need to do something. I need some money. I gotta work. I can't be sitting around fucking talking and acting like shit is right, man. That's I've been what going I'm through a lot. That's what I mean. Like I'm, we sitting, you know, party the entire. About- I, I just want to let y'all know that you know what, if they just come from work, basically. Well, I mean, I hope they don't think I just- straight to the straight to the cast. Like, yo, what's good? Straight from work, got in the lift, lift my ass right here. Now I'm here on the mic. Like, what's good? Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't know. There was some shit, but <clears throat> I ain't fucking with none of that shit, man. <laughs> I ain't either. But I just, uh, I just people ain't respecting the game. At the end of the day, there's a game that's being played in every lane, man. And everybody's just jumping lanes and thinking that they can bring that shit over. And that shit don't work. That shit is a gamble, nigga, and everybody's taking gambles to get mad when they crack. <laughs> 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 It's insane how people get upset when they crack. I know. You gambling. You can't get upset. You can't. Nah, you can't. You, you can't. don't beat up the you walk I, out the I, casino I never, mad. Yeah, you but do. you don't go back popping shit. No. No, no, no. No, you ain't supposed to take it out you, of nobody else. You you went in there thinking. I'm glad you I had learned. a master plan. Yeah. I'ma sit on the left. <laughs> I'ma sit on the left. <laughs> I'ma sit on the right right uh-huh. here. Because if I sit on the right, nah, man, that's the lucky one right there because it was like seven people in front of me <laughs> like nah man <coughs> they just fucking happy go lucky ass <laughs> respect the game <coughs> and if people respect the game a lot of niggas then we should it be a lot easier things would run a lot smoother there wouldn't be so much hating going on it's a lot of hating because then you can't hate without respect if you respect the game, that's what now go back to your boy. Yeah. Dude, come on. You've been <laughs> out there rolling. Yeah. You are with the you rolling with the hottest of the hottest. Yeah. yeah. You were slaying by accident. Yeah. If not toppy top all the time. <laughs> I could imagine. Right. Right. Toppity top. Shut up, man. Yeah. No disrespect, but yeah. this is the one. This is just nineties rap, right? Right. Two thousands rap, right? Right. So, top man, listen. And then the one time somebody put their foot down, you go insane. Can you imagine? But oh my you, god, I, I not a man of the cloth. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm done, man. Oh, oh, you. I that, just thought it. You I mean, respect the game, man. You, you can't mix all that shit. No, you can't, you can't. That should become goulash. And yeah, everybody yeah. don't like goulash. Especially when you, you know what? The thing that gets me is that the being in the public eye, knowing that your every word is like actually recorded to the fact that you could fart wrong and the nigga could tell you what it smelled like. You know what I'm saying? And throw that shit right straight on social media. And then here you are looking stupid. I don't want to. I don't like seeing like you know the buffoon. Basically, it's just like, bro, come on, come on, man. You need to leave that. Let that go. You do it. You you a genius. You so called call yourself a genius. Geniuses don't do what you do. Yeah, they don't. But I mean, yeah, they do. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. Not everybody, like that. Everybody not like was, that. I mean, not so, not so blatantly embarrassing. Come on, if your mom, if, imagine if your mom was alive, you're alive. Your mom probably, boy, what you doing? What you doing? I remember my mom told me that when I was, I was crying because <laughs> one of my girlfriends, I caught my girlfriend with one of my best friends and shit. So, <laughs> you know. I wasn't with her, kind of. I wasn't with her, but it's just the fact that your man did. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then I was in that puberty at the time. I ain't gonna front, but he was, and he was. So they was, and he stole her. He ain't stole her. I, didn't, I wasn't. Nigga, I had other man. That's so why he was mad. I wasn't mad. I was. I hurt. Was hurt. Because <laughs> that's my. Hurt that's my best <laughs> friend. That's my nigga. 
Yeah, yeah, but he knew so that. We was in a, so who knows? No, that hey. he, he could hit it too. You don't care. Oh. At, at the time, at the time, right? So this is what I'm saying. Well, mom, the story is, is that I go home, I'm crying. So my mom go, why are you crying? And I told her what happened. She's like, boy, shut that shit up. <laughs> shut that shit up. She did. She said, shut that shit up. She said, that's why you keep you always keep you more than one girl. That's what she told you? Hell yeah, my mother told me that. And that's what. She said, always keep you more than one girl because she said, because if one fuck up, you always have one to back up. And you know what? When she told me that, like the light bulb in my head went off. And that's how I was, bro, for a long time. I mean, oh, I wasn't respecting the game too because I wasn't telling, I wasn't letting chicks know. I wouldn't tell them shit really. But this is what I'm saying. I had a don't ask, don't tell policy. All right. So this is not how you're not respecting the game. I wasn't. I wasn't. I'm just saying I wasn't respecting the game because they ain't asking me shit. I ain't telling them. All right. Fuck that. And this is the game. Yeah, they didn't tell you lied. How I'm lying if I didn't, you never asked me. I ain't telling you sh Well, <laughs> Well, they was you saying they was your girl though? That will make a difference in the way you. You know what? When I started, I don't. Cause that used to be the thing. I've noticed that as I got older, and I, I kind of like start letting chicks know what it is off top. They either had to respect that, or they knew what to do. I'm not pressed for them. You know what I'm saying? I do. They do that. I gotta tell the chick quick. Tell them quick. I always say, yo, I don't need you. <laughs> my mama taught me how to wash my own drawers and I could cook for myself. And you know what's crazy? I think that dude fuck everything up too. It does. Because right? I feel like that. Like I do my because I love I doing laundry. I, 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 I do love my, cooking. I could do all so that. I don't like that ain't but, what's gonna hit. But no, but you know something? When you have a good woman though that does all those things, does those things. Without uh, the, the whining and the crying, it makes it all the world better. Good, you know what I'm saying? No, I'm not saying that. Yeah, I'm just saying. But I do like doing like, my life. I like cleaning up. Yeah, I like cleaning my crib. So that's not. I like been, mopping and sweeping. That's never been the, and making sure my yo son. I like doing that. That that's when never I was, been my. I never knew my that. At a young age, my mom telling us, teaching, making us do these things. As I got older, I started, you know, and it it actually shows. It shows on the dude. We used to have every no shit going on in here. Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Look at, come on. You go to some man, oh Lord. Some niggas ain't respecting the game, and some chicks ain't respecting the game either. They didn't even freaking check their shit. <laughs> <laughs> Read the manual <laughs> for real, cause I don't know what kind of whole training they got, cause I'll be wondering like, yo, 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 shorty, 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 shorty. Why you have a kid, and you know, like, yo, it's good. <laughs> and these, and any nigga that fuck with you, they just as worse. They just as worse. Just as much. For real, son. Man, listen. I'm just saying, there's a lot of different. There's mad shit when you look at it. I look at shit mad. You can't be mad at shit. Life like is a gamble, I, right? If you gamble. You know what? Then, see, that's something that I had to. I started. I, I, I wish I could go to like some kind of retreat every now and then because I had to learn to realize that, you know, I cannot. Tell you, I try I not. I, I stopped fucking with people because of that. In a way that I feel you, because because I at least gotta. I feel you. I need to be. As much as I like to be around people, so I like to be around people that so, respect the game, <laughs> like the, the game, like whatever lane they in. Yeah, they stay in that. They've been in that lane, and that's their lane. Yeah. It's not like that. The video shit is wild, boy. Yeah. Shit is wild. You can't wake up and just be in a different lane on me. You can't even. And I'm supposed to just be like, what? 
Yeah. Just like embrace it. Yeah. Like nothing, like no type of I got a hold of poker face. Like, nah. Yeah, right. I don't know. I don't know. Be yourself. Actually, that I don't need you to front or talk different when I come around. What the fuck is wrong with you? I speak your language. <laughs> Last time I checked. <laughs> The fuck are you over there changing the subject? Like, <laughs> right, I'm out of here. Deuces. <laughs> Got no time for this shit. I heard that. That's how I be feeling. So it's just like, all right, I know who I can go around and get a good laugh. And then I know who do you, who you go around and you want to. I don't want to cry. I don't want to think. Oh, I don't I'm to... leaving here not I, to think. I, right, right. So if I'm in a bad right, space, right. to be around people that's right. in a bad space puts yeah. me in a bad space. Right. I don't want to be around motherfuckers like all that. day. Drama or just I'm yeah. leaving hoping that you could cheer me up. Yeah, right. Exactly. That's the kind of that's the kind of like running away from my problems with but running into the arms of people that I think would have my back or care about my mental or some shit like that. I copy that. You understand? Know but niggas go through shit. People go through shit. You know what? And I I can't blame nobody though, because I don't tell nobody shit. One thing I learned about casting though, a lot of people may not see it this way, but it's therapy because you you get to voice your your opinions. You know, you get to be comical. You get to be whatever. Be yourself. You know. A lot of people use this as an opening. That's what me and Unc started it for. Like it was just, we was talking to each other more, using the shit. Right. And then we just started getting equipped. We just started getting shit that we still wasn't even understanding that what we was going to be able to do with all the shit that we <laughs> haven't got. He just, kept, he just kept popping shit up, like whatever. Yeah. Like whatever look, he look, showed look, me and look, broke it down. So look now, it's like, look at it now. But, but uh, it was a way to get my shit off. I like to get my shit off. That's why I always used to like talk like live because that Bro, that way there ain't no take backs. You know, I, was, I ain't taking shit back. Okay, I'll, <laughs> <laughs> so if I ain't say excuse me or my bad before the show was over, <laughs> then it is what it is. The game was already live. <laughs> I don't care if you press press play now. <laughs> I already said it. There's no editing. There's nothing. 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 I'm about to stop that though, because we're going to the Patreon page, which I'm gonna have wise put in the show notes. Where I'm gonna do two and more episodes where we can do give it up, give it up. Okay. No censorship. Okay. And then that way, YouTube don't dictate. YouTube and none of these road play, shit places can't dictate. Oh, I'm just gonna get blocked or none of that shit. I'm, so I don't really be trying not to get no strikes on you. That, that's uh, but I on love the Patreon you. page. I love YouTube. That is pre-recorded, so we can edit. YouTube was a beautiful thing when it first came out. That's before it became I really, money. Yeah, you know what? Money, it, money. It's, 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 no, it, no, it's not. It, it is a money grab, man. Yeah, but you know who the who hold who holds. The yeah, old mother. Okay. Nobody respects the game. No, they don't. They don't. But everybody know the game. I love YouTube, man. You can do everybody know the game and complain about the game, but play the game. It, it, that's the crazy thing about it. So then I don't got nothing to say. See, that, that's I'm crazy. not talking to those people no more. That is so crazy. You yeah, play. I have no I have no more energy towards those people. Damn, bro, you you know what? I respect you. I respect I, that everybody. I that the sound effects right now. It's really, <laughs> Don't, I respect that, that everybody's different. That's it. So I respect what lane they in, and I just never gonna switch to that lane. Definitely. So I don't need to talk about that lane. No. I just don't understand how you can complain. Exactly. It just baffles me that you'll you'll keep playing the game. You're not willing to just go cold turkey, dry, struggle, sacrifice for nothing. You'll play the game and just keep whining. Yeah, that's like me. Yeah, I ain't I'm gonna done lie. With that shit. I ain't gonna lie. Like you call it sensitive people. You can call it. I was doing that for a little watch bit. Watch what like all that is trash. I'm not gonna say nothing with no thing. I'm just gonna say all of y'all. Like anybody who feels that way is a piece of shit. <laughs> that's it to me. I got you. You understand yeah. what I'm saying? I got you. <clears throat> you whining, whining for man. You playing the game. 
I learned to stop crying about the games I be deciding to play. See, I had to realize. I had to so when I go into a job, mentally. Recently, I had to realize. Mentally, that. I gotta get out of. I know what comes with this title. I know what you know, comes with this role. So when I go to the job, I mentally prepare myself. Yeah, that's why I get super hot. <laughs> I get real high. I have one one cup of coffee, and I am fucking good to go and deal with like, the world. <laughs> that's what you got to get ready for the world. Yeah, I'm walking do. into people's houses. You don't know if they don't have an attitude. You don't know if they did a quote unquote don't like you because. We coming in here. Wait till summertime come. Between me and him, we just tat it on. We walking into your, a million dollar house to be a dishwasher. The 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 perception that may come across so many different people. True, but you, you know, know what I'm saying? Something? So you but gotta you prepare yourself. Yeah, true. That's you know something. for anything. And knowing that you're saying that, I, I'm doing the kind of work that I've done in the past, um, and going to this to different people. Homes and knowing that these are half million dollar homes, million dollar homes, you know, six hundred thousand dollar homes, you know, and these people, you're right? Nick, I know. Right. Until they, till they see that you're not what they were, their perception of of that what you're. I mean, is, what you sell the product is they, the final sell. Yeah, what I'm saying. I'm selling, good at that part, but but I'm just saying everybody's not that fortunate. No, they're not. So, but but I'm saying, but that's the game. You know the game, though. And so, if I go there, and then they be upset because they're feeling some type of way about the, or one of them might understand we're here for a job, but the other one come and like want to hover and make sure. Move oh my purse. God! Or something like oh that. Oh my Listen. God! Yo, we, I have been on the job. Been okay, on the job so like now that. you got to me- like mentally, I prepare you know, myself you know, for anything. That is the worst. Thing you can do to a contractor is I mean, hover. It is what it is. Especially if you're hovering. You gotta be a good talker. If, if you're hovering from a distance and not like ball, that's different. But if you're hover, standing over. I mean, if you are, if it's two of y'all, then the hovering, like, I, like, the so, hovering, you just hope that they're good conversations. Like you some hope them, that. Yo, some of them, yes. Like if some not, them. if not, then they'll just chime in every now. And yo, bro, I've met people who. Just for, man, tell me they hold tell, man. I met people. Man, man, man. And you're not even a million dollar homes. Yo, and, and my man all holes. And, 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 <laughs> different holes. And, and, Everybody tell you they try Oh, now. they love the dog. It's the older you know one. I'm gonna tell you it's the older one. You know what I learned? I learned this. I learned to um But they don't tell us their problem, they tell us their kids' problem. That too. Like, I learned that too. Like I wish my kids just grow the fuck up. <laughs> hey, but they not respecting the game because they keep yeah, they in they like them. a kid. True. So you gotta respect the game. You can't complain on one end and then fucking keep playing the game. Yeah. Then you're a hypocrite. Yeah. God gonna... forbid you call anybody a hypocrite. <laughs> like, I don't even know what the punishment is for that. But I ain't calling nobody a hypocrite. I'm just saying, and don't that fall under like hypocrite? Yeah, right? Of... I'm just saying, I don't know the definition completely, but I know what though. Sometimes when it comes to your child, you... I'm not saying that. I'm saying respect the game. Man. If you if you if you raise us to spoil you brat, then be prepared to manage a spoil you brat. Absolutely. Period. That's Absolutely. it. Absolutely. And you gotta manage that shit so that it's not falls on something where you always complain like you didn't know your kid was a spoil your brat when you took him to the birthday party <laughs> and somebody slapped him. <laughs> like I don't understand none of this shit. Like respect the game. Oh. You know your kid is a spoiled brat. Oh my god! Yo, you know I, getting pushed is light because you beat the shit out of him. <laughs> you know, the fuck? <laughs> Respect the game, man. Leave the little nigga alone. Don't make yo, a big scene. For real, for real, yeah, for real. Don't be embarrassed. That is the worst. That is kind of like the. That is one of the on Family Feud. That probably be number one answer. I'm uh, just saying, people don't respect the game, man. You gotta respect their all aspects. Somebody's not respecting the game at some point. And until we figure it out, start figuring it out, then you just don't know that this shit is a game and you just, I mean, it's the, you know, everybody was dealt the hand. No, I dealt. wasn't respecting the game, but I learned that. I you gotta respect that the game. When you do the things. Because you respecting the game. Yeah. You ain't fighting, now you ain't swimming upstream. 
nah, in a fight, downstream. You know what I'm saying? No now you rolling with it. Yeah. You decided to just turn on your back and float yeah. and enjoy the ride. Like, yeah, then I'm not stupid. This one thing I understand is that you know what? A person who goes through a lot of things and they come out of it and just basically just come out of it way better than what they were before. So that says a lot. Got to respect the game. It says a lot. I tell you, when you start respecting the game, it ain't about nothing but understanding the role. You can't be in this lane, jumping in this lane, and thinking that you you are the brain. Well, you know something? You can't you be can, the brain. You can <clears throat> you can jump in the different lanes. But there's only, there's a you got to jump in the lane and first understand that lane before you jump into the next lane. Because sometimes once you instead of understanding this lane, you got to understand this lane to move into the next lane. You can't be just moving into the next lane blinded. blinded no, but I'm not even talking about just moving into the next lane. You can understand the game on the, like, that lane. Don't mean that you're not thinking you can bring your smarts from this game that you don't even know might be outdated. <laughs> and then come to this game where they say, hey, yeah, like, do it my yeah, way. Yo, and it, that's, that's what I'm saying. Well, that's true. And oh, you can't that's all you about can't, you can't if you're not respecting the game, then you yeah. learning in this game. You just called, switch lanes. That means that whoever you befriend in this lane, that's called you are evolved. learning from that person now. Yeah, because called, this is their lane. Not adapting. You gotta learn to adapt. Dude, I'm just saying this that life. people don't respect the game. If you think about it, I'll tell you, I've been saying, I thought about it in all aspects, man. Do not respect the game. You can't be. I wasn't. You can't go into the next lane thinking your shit is smarter. The lane you in don't mean shit to the people in this lane. Oh, for sure. That's why I say so, you got to understand yeah. this lane first before you move over to the next lane. You know what I mean? Because whenever you drive, just it's like when I think about it, it's like when you drive. That's like when you driving, because that's how they you, with the concept is as well. You driving, you can't move in the next lane and not making sure there's no cars coming. You know what I'm saying? Because you move on the next lane, there's a car. You end up. And that's when I realized to stop fucking looking for people that you would think support you or have your back, approval on anything. Because if you wait, if you sit back waiting for that approval, it, uh, you 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 it'll slow you down. It will slow you down. It'll slow you down. And it will. <clears throat> mentally, it'll slow you down. Oh yeah, for sure. Physically, not maybe not. It will, it, it, it'll it'll slow you down. It's it'll slow heavy weight. It can slow you down because you you go into a a a a, 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 a really messed so, up state of mind, bro. So when I heard a lot of that, I was there. So now you figure now the gamble is all right, cool, all right. I accept. now I understand that that was the game, right? You know what I'm saying? I right. I, I respect the game. You can't you can't that game wasn't everybody. It's not for everybody. Everything is not for everybody. I'm just gonna say that. That's true. So everything is not for everybody. That's true. So once now that I understand that everything is not for everybody. Fuck everybody right now until <laughs> I get to what everything I'm trying to get to. That be my mindset. You understand what I'm saying? Because I did it. I like I'm trying or everybody like no. Yeah, obviously somebody doing somebody. I gotta do my own shit everybody. at some time. Yeah. You gotta be your own person at some time. But this is what's fucked up. To be your own person, you have to, you only could you only could surround yourself with people that even have an idea of what you're trying to do. That care. Enough to understand what you're trying to do. Oh, yeah. Because there's not a lot of people that understand what you're trying to do. That's they right. understand what you're doing. That's right. They see what you're doing. That's right. They understand what you're trying to do. Right. They don't even know they can't see the bigger picture because the bigger picture never matters. Well, they don't your see bigger picture. They see that this is what I'm saying. With this is where relationships got all twenty fucked up for me. And it really started leaning, and I don't, I'm gonna get seasick. And I'm like standing and gliding like this. <laughs> I don't feel it. I can't only for hold dog for so long, That's and right. I can't swim. Right. So I have to get. I have to like when I seen a little drop low, low ground. You can't swim, nah, nigga. Listen, Puerto Rico ass, nigga. I live by TSS, nigga. Oh my, my god, nigga, Betsy head, motherfucker. No, far that was. I don't give a shit. I was mad, yeah. Everybody in East New York and they mama used to go to Betsy head. I bro. probably did with my mama. And then if you ain't go to Betsy, 
I probably went when and I was And you've little. never been to the I've been to rap. BRC? I, mean, I don't know. BRC, I don't know none of that. Oh, shit. hell no. They had no BRC by me. The BRC is the shit right off of... Um, yeah, but I live by TSS, nigga. I know what she is. Wasn't, that shit was a long ride, nigga. Get the fuck out of here. 218 was nowhere near by you. Damn. You went, to, yeah, you went to Jeff. I went to 218. I ain't go to Jeff. Well, Jeff is over there. Pitching them with the Jeff. All right, Jeff is over there. 218 is all the way on the other side. It was no Shit, I went to Dewey, nigga. Side. I was in Coney Island going to school. Fuck that. But damn, son. Yeah, that's... I don't know, nigga. So I'm tired of hanging on boats. Like that. that's what the fucking point of moral story was. <laughs> like, I don't no fucking boat. I'm sorry, bro. I just don't want to hang on a boat. That's it. And I'm it, there's no 50-50. It's hard to find 50. It is hard to find. Because 50 comes. If it's 50-50, I honestly believe there's no reason to fight. Absolutely not. It can't be a reason to fight because you understand each other. That's right. If it was good. It shouldn't be you have to have a good understanding that's of one another for level. 50 50 to work. That's the respect level. Bro. Yeah, so fuck, fuck all that shit. I ain't got fuck time to work shit. towards 50 50. I got shit I'm trying to do. That's right. And, and, don't and when I get to where I'm doing, if I get to the point where I think I, I either, nah, there's no point. <laughs> when I get to where I'm going, then I, I mean, I'm, I'm willing to apologize, make amends. If it works, if it don't, like, listen. There's a, I saw something, and nobody's gonna tell me what I see. No matter. Yeah, true. You understand true. what I'm saying? True. Period. True. Your vision is your vision. What you feel you're here for is what you feel you're here for. Some people don't know their purpose. And when people feel you, people make you feel like your choice is wrong. Then it's like fuck them. Like I don't have a problem with that shit, nigga. Like I'm like Robert De Niro in Heat, Thirty Seconds Flat. I could turn that shit off, nigga. I could yeah. care from a distance, nigga. No, the world don't gotta know shit. Like to touch it. <laughs> yo, the world don't gotta know like, shit. I'm crazy, like yo. I don't gotta post it. I yeah. ain't gotta send a text. I, like, don't get I ain't gotta do shit. I can love you from yes, a right. fucking far. That's right. And sleep good. I tell you, don't get attached, man. Because you know what? I could be here today, going tomorrow. Listen, I'm listening. It's the game. The That's life, the game of life is period. You here today and could be gone tomorrow. tomorrow. So what, 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 your purpose is your purpose. What you feel like you, you're supposed to do, you're supposed to do. And if you're waiting for somebody to approve, I'm telling you, first-hand experience, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> don't do it. You got to jump. Like, you know what I'm saying? When the birds push the little, the little things out, off the, out the nest, it's like you got to fly. Oh, yeah, you do. If you don't fly, you're going to figure it out down there. Yeah. Well, somebody going to figure it out when they're going to eat you. Yeah, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, you now, nah, you got to figure it out, man. You waiting for people to jump with you. That's right. Ain't nobody jumping with you. When you can't be mad, then nobody jump with you. That should look mad far. Sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Like, you're, you you might think it's right there. Somebody else look, man, that should look like you like 100 feet in the air. You're like, this nigga crazy. I'm not jumping with him. I, I got He got me all the way to this ledge. I gotta walk all the way back home by myself because he's gonna jump. Yeah, because I ain't jumping. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes people delay your jump. Sure. Why you jumping? <laughs> you sure you gotta jump? You can walk down with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, yo, it be like, oh my yo, God, yo, man. And you, you do contemplating that shit doing damn when you wanna jump. <laughs> So now your jumping experience took that much longer. Getting to wherever the bottom was took that much longer. Everything took longer because you want to sit there and distract. Mm -hmm. That's just going to say it's a Selfishly. Selfishly. You know I want to jump. I don't told jump. you what's down don't there that jump. I'm jumping for. Don't jump. Don't do it. Don't no, do it's it. worse when you tell them what you're jumping for. Look, look at my titties. Damn, you can have me. <laughs> <laughs> when you tell somebody what you're jumping for, and they still distract you. No, no, no. You know what though? But since I've been on my little, my little straight and narrow with this, I'm glad we back, boy. I gotta get back to it, man. I'm kind of rusty, man. I, ain't, I really wasn't up to it. He ain't rusty because I know just got here from work, man. I've, been, I br I've been brushing up on. I've been brushing up on some stuff. I mean, I ain't rusty. And, like and I know I could talk. I'm looking at. I'm looking at stuff, and I'm like, you know what? I got there's a couple of things I can talk Only about. Only reason why a lot of a lot of a lot of some of 
some of the some casting. things just ain't working. No, out. some of the casters already have like they already got. Yeah, but this is not you know what I'm saying. And Followers and why, and already is, off top because of who they are from the beginning. Well, are they casters? Yeah. No, man. Yeah. Podcasters is different, man. You can record a show. Yeah. Podcasters is different. I don't even consider my. I mean, podcasters do interviews. Oh yeah. They yeah, fucking yeah. gotta get the shit edited. That that's a business, nigga. All oh, I, all true, I do true. is press record. Oh, say because we just sit here. And I just press record, man. Oh, because. No, I'm you know just what? saying, period. There's no work after that. You know what? You're right. Cause so can I be mad that I ain't got as many subscribers as wise? Hell no. No, we about to change that. Nah, but it's not even the point. That ain't it's just the point, the point that because if we got subscribers, we got subscribers. Because we are all a part of the same tree. And that's what the point That's is. what it's all about. So though I don't have time to be upset that he I'm happy I, he subscribers. I'm glad too, because that makes it all the while makes me and that inspires me to want to get it. Because now we know business wise, that's where you invest your your, your time and, and more the department gotta put more into that area. I could I could the department don't need to put nothing into this area. What you mean? We come on. I mean, I mean, not that not that the like you know the come on, I know what you're saying, but like having can't. Joe Button and Jay-Z on the same uh, <laughs> <not recognized. laughs> one nigga's not gonna eat a lot. No, there is all right. That's, I, I, I respect the game. I ain't trying to eat being, this lane. Being you said that. Who's, this ain't my lane right who, here. Who would you think would eat a lot? This ain't my lane, nigga. We all have to try something. Oh, you don't even want to say because oh, you, you don't want to start no controversy. What you said? <laughs> I said, being you said that, who you think would eat a lot out of those two? You know who would eat a lot, man. Who would I, get the budget? I know who would get the budget. All right. And that's what I'm saying. As a company, Wise gets the budget. Because his podcast is the one that's rocking. You know what I'm saying? I like the way we do that to the limit and we don't we don't even you know what I, mean? I like that. That's that's yeah. that that's dope. But it's just you gotta do it like that. We do. Cause sometimes you know what? We don't know who watching or who picked this up and then next thing you know, motherfuckers is knocking at the door or trying to And sometimes it. everything don't need the budget, man. Just happy, just happy to be here. That's it. Be happy to be here sometimes and Figure out another avenue. Hey, you know what I'm saying? That's hey, why I'm taking my shit, my time hey, to the Patreon page. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey. And then if you want to fuck, if you fuck with me, you'll get the extra two episodes. If you don't, then you gotta wait once a week to hear whatever shit we feel like talking about. Fuck yeah! Could be freestyle. Well, once still, yeah. could be still freestyle. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Once we do the two episodes on the Patreon, we'll come with a, a topic, a structure. There'll be no more. structure. Right now, this is why that's why the live is going to be a lot. Structure is the worst thing you can do to a nah, Not structure, but you're going to hit home, move on, hit home, move, move on. on. Yeah. You, yeah. you got to have structure at that point. Yeah, they, they, I've been there's like, bigger things you're trying to do. Yeah, and as you go, you can only get better. <clears> yeah, and I, on, on Patreon, I ain't even talking about structure like that. I mean, more speak more freely. Yeah. Say, with the, say, like, how it is. This topic I want to touch on that I won't touch on on YouTube. I hate you. And that's you know messed up that you got to say that because I love YouTube. But there's topics that YouTube, you're my topics baby. that because the way you, cause there's not too many nice ways to touch a lot of topics without. That's why I like, like with the Joe Rogan shit. It is what it is. I mean, I'm not shocked. So I, so as long as I'm not shocked, it don't bother me. It don't either. It doesn't. You can't bother you when you don't when you are, when you're not shocked. Like I there's not like when I heard when I heard when I heard it. it I, at, at first, I'm like, and then I, they played the, the they, they played the clips of comedian that. or not. That comedian shit don't work because com- no, there's not a lot of comedians just running around saying nigga. Listen, so we don't know what they. I'm say. just saying. I'm we, saying just like, loud. All right, nobody's like talking about the look. president. Listen, just like they called the president after he gave this big speech, and some fucking um some some reporter said asked him some out of the fucking place question. He felt like. You know the question was fucked up. Then he said, "Called him a son of a, called him a stupid son of a bitch." Didn't know it. they called it a hot mic, so they replayed it. And, and, and he, yo, the shit was funny. He had just cause they played it on the news. He had to call the motherfucking reporter 
and apologize to the nigga because he Dude, called him got, a stupid motherfucker. You got to apologize for everything. That's but I'm taking my time to preach out there. I'm saying, though. To apologize. I'm saying, though. If I, if I called you a stupid motherfucker to your face in the street, I don't need to apologize for that. No, because you should have got punched in the mouth. <laughs> See? <laughs> for every action, there's a reaction, nigga. Some people so call, word, words you? hurt you. No, no. But to because for me to there's call no you, way for you to hurt you. Let me know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me let's 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 break this down. Because you said I should have got that's, punched in the that's, mouth. That's, because listen, I called let's, it a let, stupid let's break this down. What? If you are in range to call somebody a stupid motherfucker, it's not coming out politely. Well, he wasn't in this and it's not coming out with some type of aggression. He didn't even say what he read. He thought the way he no, did it was saying, funny. Like this nigga's, he don't the way he the way what I got it was the way the president was calling. You know, this he dissed him was saying like this dude don't get it. That's oh, why he it? called him called him the not stupid listen, motherfucker, but he called him, basically called him. Listen, regardless of what, you still. I mean, listen, that nigga could have said whatever he want. I mean, he could have been a stupid motherfucker. Yeah. I don't see what's wrong with somebody being a super motherfucker. Everybody has to you say you have white girl wasted. You can say all this other shit, but you can't call somebody a stupid motherfucker. I just don't I just don't understand this shit, man. You can say somebody's wasted like a white girl, but you can't say stupid motherfucker. <laughs> you know what you know think? Girl? Let me ask you this. Who started that uh cancel shit? I don't know. I'm not See, kidding. nobody knows. I know. I have a theory. No one not, knows. It's for the Patreon page. Who is? I'm that. like, who's say the that. one that starts? Say, who? Who's the one that starts all these movements? Who the? F- I don't even. I ain't see. Oh, no, listen to me. Listen. Who are the ones who start? Eighty-five. I'm not gonna say. Okay, I get it. Eighty-five percent of these movements is backed by the same fucking group. So, so, I mean, when you respect the game, when you see the game, and you the people playing in the middle, you just shucking and jiving. Oh my god, you're killing me over here! I like the way you use shucking, shucking and, and jiving. jiving. That's yeah. it. They come fuck with yeah. us, then they bounce yeah. back to their yeah. home yeah. report. Yeah, come fuck with yeah. us. Yeah. Give us a little tea, take yeah. all the water and everything, and bring it back and make a pot for the other people. I'm man. just saying, when you respect the game, man, some, this, this is a game. It is a game. There's a lot of things that... But when you learn the rule, when you learn the rules or you have the rules to the game... And when you see it for what it is, because well, there's no right, rule. Let's put it that way. But there's when rules, the for, unforbidden rules is you know what lane you're in. Like, if you're in a lane that does 30, then you should be doing 30. Correct. If you're in a lane that does 75, then you should shut the fuck up. If you was a person that was in the 50 lane <laughs> and slipped over and thought somebody was going to slow down for your ass. <laughs> See, this is what I'm saying when people switch lanes or they try to unite. Somebody always wants to fuck and just like, yo, change what you're doing. Uh-huh. No, bitch, this is a 75. Keep up. That's it. All I can do is fucking tie you to the back of my shit. That's it. And you can't you can't change the fucking speed. The nerve of you. The nerve of these fuckers to think that that sex is that good. That you don't want to make a nigga. But, no. And it makes a lot of niggas change, change the speed. I don't give a fuck. No, man. no, you can't blame them. I'm not upset with them. Ain't no, the you ain't, no, you But you got to remind that them that great. there are a few people that uh no. that praise the you no that you gotta either keep up keep up or i see you but i lap if i have a lap back around oh well wait okay that's what i'm saying if you were if you just think that you're gonna come over from 55 and jump in 75 85 and tell them to slow down <laughs> that's what i'm saying with some people when they just get into relationships they get into relationships. somebody's that fucking i'm at 30. i'm doing a speed limit at 30 when it comes to relationships i'm like this i cruise yeah, i need I, to see the. i need to see like i need to see everything i need to understand that's everything. the mode that but how I somebody's no, coming I uh, somebody's coming in hot that's how i used to be I all right to, i used to be you yeah you were coming hot the other person uh, like that nah. this is you yeah you see the process it crash bam 
I crashed probably crashed and burned probably like oh, you crashed in a lot of times. A lot. A lot of times. Time. Time. We ain't gonna go number wise, but just a lot of times. A lot. I crashed and burned a lot. But I think this a lot of those crashes. I had a lot of bumpers. Like bump fend, what do you call fender what you call Fender benders. Fender benders. <laughs> <laughs> That's just definitely bent the fender. Yeah, I had some crash and burns, but you know what? I had no crash and burns, right? I was, learned a lot from them. I, I had a lot of dents. I had dents. I got yeah. fender benders. I had, I had fender benders. Like, I kept it moving. It still was drivable. True. But it hurt it. And it looked like shit. <laughs> it looked like <laughs> Yeah, because at least it looked like at, shit. At least it looked like shit. Yeah. But it was moving. It had, four, shit was total. It had four wheels. My shit would be total. It had four wheels. I start from zero, like this, like donut. Like, whoo, whoo. Like, I, my shit looked like the wide, the owl, the eye on the um, wide potato chip, the owl eye. Listen. That's how that shit be looking. That's how my bank account or my pocket be looking. Whenever that shit happens. Shit. With all the shit we've been doing, my pockets always look like. Woo. It feel that way. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah, but I, like you say, respect the game. So yeah, I respect the game, man. That's it. Game. If you don't pay your fucking rent for two months, five months, tw- 16 months, 24 months, they should kick your ass out. Yo, they went up on it. There should be no court should be able to fucking stop somebody from kicking somebody out. I really believe that. Like, if you decide to sit back on a hold on a minute, maybe they, they, it depends on if that, man, that motherfucker, 12 months of you, you oh, I, if you're not paying, not paying, nigga, they was giving out mad money. Nigga. If you're not paying your rent, it was giving out mad money this the last two years. Yeah. A lot of money the last two years. Yeah. If you didn't catch up on your rent, you was just knowing that you couldn't get kicked out. And that's some bullshit. And that, and respecting the game is the landlord should come there. And do whatever the fuck he wish. Not if he ain't fix, <laughs> if he ain't fix the shit. No, I'm talking about whatever. I'll get you out. He ain't gotta fix shit, nigga. You ain't paid for twelve months. You paying that? Nah, that's the bullshit. This is what I'm saying. They ain't respect it again. We know why you ain't paying, nigga. Because the government yeah. said All right, no, they government can't kick you out. No, not yet. All right, so the people is taking advantage. A lot of people was taking advantage. All they, right, they yeah. And those but, people who went, they're not respecting the game. No, 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 no. The ones who's taking advantage is not respecting. Yeah, them. that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. And if, if I was the landlord, which God thank them that I'm wow, not, you would kick them out. I have ways of get, you would have you would have kicked them out. I want to physically did nothing. You know what? You know it's legal. there's legal ways to get make things yeah, happen. Go to court, get that nah, paperwork, and nah. then tell them get the fuck you out. You speed up that process without hurting nobody. Only person gonna hurt is you. <laughs> You yeah, gotta be ready, ready. ready to eat this, and yeah, I'm ready to eat it. Nigga. Yeah, you see. I ain't even gonna. T- I've been saying that shit, or but when it was talking real, I'm telling you, that's I know, crazy. I know how to, you. I right. get you out the crib. Now, that, let me say you this: when I was watching, I was. I get you, know, you out the crib. You know, I like information, so I go. I troll a lot of shit. I ain't gonna lie. So I'm trolling through some shit and being like a, a revolver. You know, basically, you know the work we do. Um, there was this, there was a couple of these videos I watched where apparently the homeowner didn't pay the person doing the work. One 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 of the videos was where the homeowner didn't pay the dude for doing a fence. What you think the dude who didn't get paid did? I can't got my fence. That nigga, no, he the bro, he sledgehammered the whole the fence. He had had uh, uh, the crew slamming the pavers. Breaking up all the pavers, they was. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant by come get my fence. What, bro? I wasn't bringing it back with me. What? You gonna clean this bitch up? What? And figure it out. And that's not wrong with that. No, it isn't. Especially if you spend somebody, well, then money, you get what yeah, you. Well, uh, money this was. Is, this is what I'm saying. And the money was owed, and, and the dude's like, "Yo, you okay. can't give me a thousand dollars. You can't even give me a thousand dollars." The man, like, I. I he was like, okay, and this waka, is, waka, break look, everything, everybody, is, break everything, break everything. And this is where it goes to, you are good law-abiding citizens, right? Yeah, that yeah. motherfucker who ain't paid with you. are like, law-abiding citizen. Yeah. Know nothing about this, I don't play that IOU shit. <laughs> you know nothing about this lane over there. There's a lane for niggas that when they do their work, they want their money, man. Period. 
you are in this little happy hole. You just got your house. You needed all this shit touched up. Your husband told you to just chill. You like, no, I need a new this and a new that. <laughs> you get your fucking shit updated. And yeah. then you turn around and tell a nigga, I, I ain't got your money. And you expect a nigga to do what? Go to court? Come on, man. <laughs> you lucky. The court is the is the, the, the pussy way out. Right. That's the, oh, I know you. You better not do nothing because the court. Yeah. No, man, the court takes 16 months. You look like you can't afford a lawyer. All that shit. No, I'm coming to get my property. Well, I'm I'm, I'm wrong. I'm coming to destroy my property. Yeah. Because you didn't pay for it, right? Yeah. So I don't want to yeah, carry all this the back. labor. And yeah, I don't want to carry this back. Well, the, the money that was owed was like seventy. It was. It was. Nigga, that's it. Enough for me to break. Seventy-five hundred is enough for me to break. But I. I, I oh, didn't. it was breaking everything. Don't let me paint the everything. inside, because then I come spray paint the outside. <laughs> that's it like, oh shit you didn't know oh, this was the bonus <laughs> this is the bonus and i'll pull out the paint sprayer and throw rainbow colors in that fucking bucket <laughs> take this two for free i got a whole five different paints that i had in the that i was going to throw out it's some bad ass weed man so i don't know man I don't know about that, man. I, I, you gotta look at it from both aspects. Man. I ain't looking at it from no. I'm looking at it from the aspect from the person who is. Why are we broke, mad at the landlord? Then? I'd have broke that shit. No, 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 no. Too. Why are we mad at the landlord then? The landlord is one of us. Landlord ain't for fixing shit. Uh, but I don't. That's something a whole totally inside. You ain't a shitty. You ain't the best tenant. If I am the best. Tenant, All right, nigga. So if you ain't the best tenant, you know what? I would. Then you can't demand the, past, the best landlord. In the past, I know that. All right, so well, you I can't know. I can't say that because all my cribs was nice. Nah, fuck the nice part, man. The tenant itself. A disgusting tenant. I don't like that. A tenant that don't take care of the property that ain't there. It's, it's, Those tenants, because you got to remember, there's a majority that's rule. That's true. That's true. So you can't take the, the, the little bit. You can't. This is where we can't. We can't mix everybody together. That's why these groups suck. Because you people get to tag along and that don't even belong in the group. Like dead ass, siblings. and they get eaten up by the zombies. They be yeah, the first they, to go. Yeah, like they, you the shouldn't even ones be in this group. Yo, this These the groups need to tighten the fuck up. Uh, yeah, because they cause the strong ones to lose it. Yeah, if that's if this is what it's about, I'm just saying. I from outside looking in, these groups is all fucked up. Yeah, it's a, there's a there's a there's, they're not on the same page, and you can't get me to come follow you or join your your theory if y'all not even on the same page. All of y'all gotta be on the same page. It seems like y'all all on different pages depending on the circumstance. <laughs> and that shit is kind of bothersome. Like, you want me to do what? <laughs> Subscribe to what? <laughs> and then I can't even talk about this shit because right. y'all get upset. Because I'm because some you don't want to hear the truth. It's not like if somebody just blasting lies. Everybody's been through struggles, man. Oh, yeah. That's that's, sure. Everybody in the world has a struggle to tell. They have to. Every race, when I say everybody, I know what you're every saying. race, know what you're every saying. gender, any whatever, have a story to tell about that race, that specific gender, that specific whatever. Everybody has a bad story to tell. Everyone. Nobody's here to tell you that your story is just badder or badder. But one thing that's for, for without a doubt is. There's one struggle that has never stopped, never had a break. <coughs> What's that? My, the blacks. Oh. American blacks. Because they don't consider Africans. Uh, you come from another country, yeah. you're better than American blacks. I'm not saying that this is my theory. This is just the experience of 48 years I got of being in the street and locked up with different races, mixture of everybody. I get along with everybody. I learn shit from everybody. So that's the whole thing about there's a difference. There there's, there's a there's a American black thing. It's not blacks. You might African might get caught up because he hang with us. You <laughs> know what I'm saying? Cause we the shit. Like American niggas. It's just the shit. We got mad swag. This is the shit. Everybody, man. everybody loves the swag. That's the all over the world. We don't yeah, get credit for the people. swag. Nah, we don't get right. credit for none of that shit. But everything else is that people don't respect the game when it comes to just 
understanding the way that you can't be you can't blame people for shit. You just got to figure out why do we keep accepting that the oldest people in the world with most stubbornest people with the most history of the most racism because the most they, discrimination it gets in their ways and that's where you shouldn't they shouldn't be in power man i think they should be a retirement like like they like how they say retirement. senior citizens like what makes them not a senior fucking citizen how do you, you will you will give your parents up at 65 if they tremble and then these niggas fake like they all die of just natural causes and some of them be having all of these symptoms <laughs> ain't made a decision in years and just keep that nigga out of sight you know, you, you don't see that nigga on those zooms <laughs> these niggas you do not see on zoom <laughs> man of these old oh, fucks man oh, that's no. in power and government and judges and all of them they, they all die, soon die man no, dude, but we will never hear that part that they all die from old timers. No, it's because they're not going to tell you. Because then you'll be like, damn, how long is this nigga had it? How long did this nigga had it? You'll be like, yo, how long did this nigga have that? Like, if you telling me, if you telling me now, and he's been in, running the government for 17, he's been a judge for 20. 50 years, and you telling me that he just got it today? Baby, I like you. right now when you told us? No, no, no. Yo, you silly, man. I'm just saying, I respect the thing. They you should think, retire. You think, you think your boy, um, you think. Um, he shouldn't be in power after 70. I'll give him 70. No, right. I don't, I don't, no, no, no. I don't think they should be in power, period. When they, like, you shouldn't after be judging over 50. anything after fucking 65 to me. You shouldn't. 65. Shit, they take your my life. Seat, they take your drop, yo, bro. They go, whatever they do to the senior citizens out here, yeah. they need the same treatment. Yeah, they, they do, right? That's right. America, right? That's People. right. Should we talk about? That's right, man. Once you, all, once you start a war, man, I think once you start, like, yeah, they be like, they you. No, no, nigga, yo, bro, give up that seat. Man, you you get that Let me see how you walk. What? When the last huh? time you took your driver's license? Uh, off? Right? What you can't check see? This shit. What? What you forgot? Nah, what? man, we fucking up because we keep our we keep. No, they should have young. The, I we, think that we they, fighting they, the wrong people. Exactly. That's it. You know, we what? always been fighting the wrong. I mean, all races in the same group. You know, like, what? there's a group. That there's is. only two groups. There's rich, and then there's mediocre and poor. There's three. Cause we're gonna get mediocre. Mediocre is the that one that the middle the class. Bo- yeah, the bougie is. Cause rich people just tell you to suck off. The bougie <laughs> ones is the mediocre. And then you got poor people. Poor people. And that is bad. it. They don't care what color you are. Poor people don't. Either. You could be all the races and genders you want. Poor. And they not fucking with you. That's and true. you could be all the races and genders mediocre, and they are not fucking with you and you pay more taxes than the poor people but not fucking with you because they don't pay shit no they don't and this i is try the, to tell and this is the that. game man so being mediocre is what makes you better than me because at the end of the day you pay more taxes than you got and you get fucked just like i get fucked so now you fuck you getting mad at me because you won't talk to yeah you won't talk to big brother yeah don't beat your little brother up. Yeah. But at the end of the day, we all brothers and sisters. Because, and whatever. Whatever group you is. But we are them because they need us. Of course they need us. All of us. Because we give up the most bread. We work the hardest. They need us because we, that's right. And so, they know that. So then we need to really stop with the with the crime. Man. You know Respect what? the game, man. Stop crying. It's just done with the crying. I don't want to hear no more excuses. I think Thank everybody you. just that's like my, excuses to rally people up, and then point. nothing of significance happens. That's my point. Right you now. can still hang a nigga, and it's not illegal. Talk to me after that. Talk to me when shit. Let stop crying to me about anything, man. <laughs> you stupid. None of y'all groups. None of y'all groups got that. No. There's nothing in nowhere. That you could you could hang a nigga right now and it's not against the law. So what are they gonna charge you with? Manslaughter? Man. Not 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 hate crime, nothing. Nothing. And even if it's that man, listen, the law is crazy for that law to still be a law. Or to be in the law book as that. That's crazy. 
are you insane? Are you talking to me about anything changing? <laughs> that shit ain't changing. Respect the I should have brought some fucking snacks, man. Yeah, you should have. I'm kind of snacking. Man. Hey, let me get some of these, bro. And don't eat all the last of my little they, bullshit snacks. There is I no. got healthy snacks in there. What's healthy snacks? Like oh, what? Man. That's the endless pot. No, I don't end it yet. Over. It's an hour. I just was testing the water. You could do a recording. Oh, yeah. We should definitely. I'm done with this shit. It's an hour and a half on this shit. This nigga fell asleep on it. That shit was funny. Say your pieces, man, before I do this. Huh? Say your pieces and shit. Pieces. Like, peace to everybody. Peace to everybody. Mm-hmm.